Oh, it's Petra. Predictions here. There's going to be a new winner for the Women's World Cup, but regardless of that, this Women's World Cup has been groundbreaking for the whole of the footballing world. For the first time ever, three African nations have made it out of their group into the knockout round for the first time ever in a men's or a women's FIFA World Cup at senior level. The 2023 FIFA Women's World Cup has seen six different nations do their best ever at a World Cup. South Africa and Jamaica both made it out of the group stage and into the knockout round for the first time ever and impressively Jamaica did this at the expense of Brazil and South Africa and Jamaica's men teams haven't even made it out of the group stage in a World Cup. Colombia had a good run and made it to the quarterfinals for the first time ever which is actually the same record as the men's Colombian team have made in a World Cup. Hosts Australia have put on a cracking performance in their World Cup and they have reached the semi-finals for the first ever time which is a much better record than the Australian men's national team have done in a World Cup. England of Spain made it to their first ever World Cup final and regardless of the outcome, one of them has to do that better and win their first ever World Cup. 2023 FIFA Women's World Cup will be the second time that a nation has won both the men's and the women's World Cup with the only other nation being able to do this is Germany. With the number of nations doing their best ever at a FIFA Women's World Cup with the various plots and twist with the quality of play and the USA finally not dominating the FIFA Women's World Cup and doing their worst ever at a Women's World Cup. I believe this Women's World Cup in 2023 has been the best to date. Let me know your comments in the comment section below. Do you think it's been the best Women's World Cup so far and how much do you think women's football has progressed? Do you think this World Cup in 2023 could be a massive stepping stone for women's football in the future? And as always, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next video.